In packaging, PP stands for polypropylene, a particularly popular and practically perfect plastic for packaging products, possibly. Polypropylene is the third most common packaging plastic, and it's marked with a number five on the resin code. And it's recyclable. Polypropylene, being one of the toughest of the six main types of plastic, is a great choice for applications that require strength and durability. The material is also high in resistance to fatigue, so it can withstand significant amounts of stress and movement before breaking down. This makes it ideal for items with hinged parts or moving mechanisms, such as flip-top caps, disc-top caps, pumps, sprayers, child-resistant caps, and lids of all kinds. Also, polypropylene's rigidity and its ability to hold its shape at high temperatures makes it an excellent choice for tubs, jars, and other containers that might be used for industrial hot fill processes or be placed in the dishwasher. Due to it having a high distortion temperature above 200 degrees Fahrenheit, and in some cases 240 degrees Fahrenheit, it is often the best plastic option for products that will be exposed to high heat as most other plastics will distort at such temperatures. The natural color of polypropylene is a translucent, cloudy color that in the industry we refer to as natural colored. However, it can also be clarified, a process that removes much of the plastic's haziness and makes it almost entirely clear. The plastic can also be produced in virtually any color, commonly with an opaque finish. The most common stock polypropylene colors usually include natural, clarified black and white, though other colors can be ordered or created. Common uses for polypropylene include furniture, carpet, clothing, electronics, construction materials, automotive pieces, lab equipment, and of course, packaging. And this diversity of applications is thanks to the plastic's resistance to fatigue and chemicals, and because the material is relatively inexpensive to produce and work with. And like most of our stock packaging, polypropylene is BPA-free. Now, proceeding to pass the positives previously presented, polypropylene might not be a practical pick for you personally, provided particular product properties. In other words, polypropylene is not going to be the best packaging choice for everything. For one, this plastic does not have a great resistance to the cold, as it can become stiff and brittle at temperatures around and below freezing. It's also worth pointing out that polypropylene is usually injection molded, which results in most polypropylene containers having a slight taper to them. This isn't an issue, but it can make sticker application a little bit tricky, usually requiring a custom-shaped label to accommodate the container's taper. Also, other materials are recommended for your container if your product is prone to evaporation, contains solvents and potent oils. Lastly, not all polypropylene packaging is ideal for hot fill or dishwasher use. So, as with all packaging, it's important that you test your product with the packaging that you're interested in to make sure that the container is a good fit for your product and your processes. If you have more questions about polypropylene or would like to see a sample, please contact us and we'd love to help.